Open House Art Festival started last year. Um, a group of GSA students um, led by Amelie Silvani Jones were kind of stuck in this rut, this post graduating rut. What are we going to do? We can't really get into galleries, but we want to make stuff. Um, so they decided to kind of join together. The idea of putting an exhibition on your house isn't really anything new. Um, open houses run across the world. So it just seemed obvious that Glasgow should have had something. Artists are really appreciate the opportunity to bring it all together and really draw in the attention of Glasgow's general public. So absolutely, I think it will happen again and we're really hoping that it will become a sort of annual or biannual occasion for Glasgow's artists. into the craft movement and we were really inspired by the Macintosh and other kinds of craft movements from Glasgow and so we were excited about decorating our house from head to foot like every inch like painting it and decorating it in some sort of handmade way. I wanted to submit a proposal for Open House um, to kind of highlight Caledonia Road Church. It's quite a unique building and nobody's really, you know, there's not been too much um, done with it recently. Uh, there's been a couple of shows throughout the past year, so I just wanted to um, reflect on Caledonia Road Church as uh, kind of a centre for a ritualistic purpose. I don't know a single soul in this new place. It's been a close collaborative process this, uh, we, we each have a kind of a component each of this, so I myself I've built the kind of main architecture of the space, the structures that we see in the space, uh, while Augustus uh, has cast a few figures and Emma has done these miniature sort of plaster casts that are sort of populating the space within my structures. My name's Ellen Doggett, um, I'm studying uh, a Masters of Letters at the Glasgow School of Art um, and we're exhibiting as a bit of a collective in the arches for Open House. My artwork is about ecology and about preservation of um, plants. So I'm one of the six people that's showing in here. It's good to be part of a, a bigger exhibition before we do it more like um, individual exhibitions. It's more, slightly more tense, but this is more happy and like a, a whole family show. It's very interesting, uh, it's very in unusual places, which does make it quite relaxing as well. My name is Joanna Monks and I'm one of 14 artists and writers who are exhibiting in the first of the Lauriston Arches for the Open House Festival. This exhibition is called This House Has Been Far Out at Sea and it's about the use of language and storytelling. She pushes her way through the hordes of tourists and locals gathered in the small square for the Saturday market. and uh, the show is uh, State of Mind uh, Hotbox and it's at the Lauriston Bar uh, which is in the Gorbals um, and the show is actually uh, based in the smoking area.
We decided to embrace, to some extent, the ethos of uh, uh, Open House Festival and to experiment in a collaboration between uh, me and Hannah Braxton. We decided to occupy temporary uh, our front garden, a bit of land which generally is kind of forgotten and, uh, and abandoned to some extent, uh, in, at least in this street. This is a fairly different project to my normal work. I normally work in model making, video and sculpture and this is a different project, it's a collaboration between myself and Ellie Harrison. And the project's called Money Meal and it's about eating money and talking about money. The show that we have produced for Open House is a show in the disused basement space that is underneath my flat. It is a derelict space that's not used throughout the year. The work of three artists are shown there, that's myself. We are a filmmaker, Eileen Daly, and a painter named Ariane Jackson. My name is Abigail Neat Wilson. I'm an artist based in Glasgow and I have collaborated with Fionn Duffy, Josie Turnbull and Alex Kuzik to make Bleachfield, which is an exhibition held in the Botanic Gardens as a part of Open House Festival. The exhibition is a culmination of both collaborative and individual research about the site of the Botanic Gardens. My name is Rachel Rebus. I'm an artist working and living in Glasgow. Our exhibition, Cold on the Outside, is a collection of um, painters from all over the world. Um, so along with myself, there's anne Kristen Hagesetter, Paula MacArthur, Suki Berwick and Anna Karkar. And the purpose of our exhibition was to show the importance of dialogue among artists when creating work. What we did with the show was we made a parallel computer game of the space so that you could go online and anybody could control the curation and when the curation got submitted we would then go and change it in the physical space as a way of exploring how the anonymity of the internet can allow uh, engagement without kind of being judged or without prejudice. My name is Robin Benson, I'm an artist based in Edinburgh and this is the exhibition Structural Proposition is Greater Than or Equal to Sensible Reasoning. So the show itself is basically looking at the transition between proposition and actuality, looking at sort of diagrams and models and how they can represent structural stability and architectural forms. Try